Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Zanika Marie and our dope discussions. If you're new, welcome to you. Um, today is going to be one of our quick dope discussions, but we're going to try to make it as informative as possible for my brothers out there. A lot of you guys come to me asking for advice as far as dealing with women today and some of the tips and tricks that you guys can implement in order to, I don't know, navigate better. All right. And so with this quick dope discussion, we're going to be talking about three things that will turn a woman off. Okay. Again, please listen up because a lot of you guys may not even be aware of some of these small but very important things that very well may be turning women off from you, okay? Now, the first one, it should be a no-brainer, if you will, but a lot of men sleep on the importance of, yeah, you guessed it, bad breath. Oral hygiene, brothers, is something that you do not want to sleep on. It's something that you absolutely want to take care of because it's one of the very first things that a woman can pick up on, okay, when you are trying to engage in a conversation. And it's nothing worse then let's say you're an attractive guy. And it's like, okay, he's coming to talk to me. And then he opens his mouth. Oh, once again, I got to hit the Zoom. He opens his mouth. And it's like, now you're too fine. Look, you, you, you are way too fine, way too attractive to be having these kinds of aromas, if you will coming from your mouth. Like you, you got to make sure fellas that you are taking care of your dental hygiene. You want to make sure that you're brushing properly. Um, you got, you want to make sure that you're flossing, you know, just mints. Okay. It can all be so simple. Gum, all of that could help. Um, but you definitely want to make sure that your breath is a one, your, your breath is on point because well, again, that's the first thing that a lot of us will experience when it comes to interacting and engaging with a man. So you got to make sure the breath is on point, y'all. And I, I really do feel like a lot of y'all just kind of skip over that. Like you, you make sure that your wardrobe is good. Make sure that your hair is nice, your shoes. But then that breath, brother, you know. Like you, you got, and again, th this, this should be common sense and common knowledge, but it's not, trust me, it's not. So, um, yeah, take care of that breath. All right, you guys moving on to the second thing on our list. And this is something that is absolutely, uh, a major turn off to a lot of women. And once we pick up on the fact that you are this type of guy, we are immediately fleeing from you, okay? And that is a guy that is a straight up and down mooch. Yes, you are a mooch. You always are trying to latch on to anybody and anything just so you can benefit, but you're not adding on in any positive ways. You're just there to take. You're just there to lounge around, not... Uh, be an asset to anybody's life, but just, again, strip away things. You are a liability. A mooch is a major liability, and this will absolutely turn off women. Once we start to see that you are not ambitious, not self-sufficient, always trying to look for the next person to come up off of, we don't want anything to do with you. And this is why I'm always encouraging men to make sure that they are being self-sufficient, being productive, 
and making sure that they're adding some kind of value to their lives that way they can stand out and stand apart because again you guys female nature tells us as women to look for stable men men that can give us stability and security men that can lead us teach us guide us and direct us and if you are a mooch, you're pretty much trying to live off of me. You're pretty much looking to me for all of your guidance, all of your help. You are looking to me for me to bring you stability and security. And I'm sorry, you guys, when we see mooches, we just see a weak man and it's an instant turn off. <sighs> you know what? Something that is a major turnoff for women that a lot of you guys do not take that seriously is bad skin. Yep. It's your skin. It's your skin. Like, I don't know why some of you guys do not make the proper investments and take the time out to really make sure that your skin is hydrated, your skin is glowing, your skin is smooth, acne-free, wrinkle-free, whatever. It can be such a major turnoff when we see a guy. And once again, he may be attractive otherwise, but because his skin is just bumpy and dry, flaky, uh, let, let me tell you guys something. It was this guy that I used to work with back in the day, right? And he was tall, charismatic, and like we were into like sales, you know, we, we did a lot of selling and stuff of that sort. Now, I personally didn't, didn't do any selling. I just would like, I was like the secretary, if you will. I would just like sign people in and put them in the queue, stuff of that sort. But then they would wait along for a sales rep to come and service them. And this guy, he was tall, he was charismatic, he was funny and everything, great salesman. But his skin, you guys, and I've actually heard customers make remarks about it. It was like, oh gosh. But they like he would go into the back to get um whatever merchandise they were trying to sell to the customer at that time, whatever merch that the customer wanted them to bring out to, you know, I, mean, I guess play with before they bought, you know, whatever it was they wanted to get. And I would hear them whispering like, oh my gosh, did you see, did, did you see his skin? Like, mm, such a good guy, but you know, his skin was just a little bit, it's a little flaky. It's, it's distracting. Like it, it was so distracting for them that even though he had this great big personality, he was fun, uh, he was interactive, they could not get over how flaky and dry his skin was, you know? And so it doesn't even have to be necessarily that you have acne or bumps or pimples or redness or anything of, of that sort. It could be that your skin is just like absolutely dry and we see that it needs to be tended to. That could be a turnoff. Like you can be a great guy, but... If we can't get over like the most basic thing about you, like as far as your skin, we look at you, it's like dog, like it's a, it's a straight up and down distraction. So you want to make sure that you guys are absolutely taking care of your skin. You don't want to walk around dry and flaky. You don't want to walk around with bumps and pimples and, you know, pus and redness. You just don't want any of those things. You don't want any of those problems because, again, you can be a great guy, but because I can't get over, you know, how your skin is looking, I'll pass you up. can also come off as gross, okay? And, and I say that respectfully. It can be gross. Like, if you, if you, if you fellas, for example, if you fellas saw a woman... Right. Let's say that she had a, a nice body, a nice shape and everything. 
but let's say she had great big craters in her skin and she had boils and pimple like y'all would be turned off it's like yeah she's a cool girl nice shape nice body but ugh, you know i don't how can i kiss her um how can i cuddle with her like how can i not see that I, how can i look past that so you want to make sure you guys I, I just cannot stress this enough take care of your skin take care of your skin take care of your skin now luckily you guys we do have a special treat for you guys just in case it could be something that you're struggling with as far as your skin stay tuned for this watch this really quick and i'm telling you guys it could be an absolute life changer for you okay crown heads you already know i'm super excited about today's sponsor you guys have absolutely heard me talk about them before and i'm pretty sure you're going to keep hearing me talk about them because i know the positive impact their products will have on your life okay and that sponsor for today is none other than teach hanley okay seriously crown heads I still don't think some of you believe me when I tell you how much implementing a quality skincare routine will improve your confidence in every aspect of your life. T. Hanley makes taking care of your skin uncomplicated. They provide you with all the products you need and nothing that you don't. I recommend you guys start with their level one system, which comes with all of the basics. A daily face wash, an exfoliating scrub, a morning moisturizer with the SPF 20, and a nighttime moisturizer. Oh, and to make it super easy, crown heads, Tej Hanley will provide you with an instruction card in every box that tells you when to use each product, how much to use, and in what order to use it in. It definitely comes in clutch. But you don't have to take my word for it because they have over 5,000 five-star reviews from customers from all over the globe. This isn't something you want to put on because prevention is key. Get ahead of any signs of aging now. Your future self will thank you. Now, in addition to amazing skin, members of Teach Hanley get tons of benefits including at least 20% off the retail price, access to exclusive monthly deals, and you can pause and cancel at any time, and you guys, it's free U.S. shipping. And because Teach Hanley is sponsoring today's video, they're offering my crown heads a great deal. Just click the first link in the description and you'll get 30% off your first box, plus a free gift. Like seriously. That's an amazing deal. Click that link below and get started today. Oh, yes, crown heads. Go and get your Teach Hanley. Like, you guys, I had my friend Leo come over and try out the, this Teach Hanley product. And he absolutely loved it. I am not exaggerating. He was in love with it. He said that his skin felt so smooth and hydrated. Um, he, he, he said it smelled good. Like these products, they not only are really good for your skin, but they also have a very nice masculine um, kind of fragrance to them. And again like he absolutely loved it and I, I felt his skin for myself and i was like yes it, it does feel very nice very smooth he smelled good the whole nine i noticed a new glow on his skin everything so definitely hit that link down below and go and get your teach hanley i'm telling you guys you will not regret it all right and they have a special discount available for crown head nation so you definitely want to take advantage of this while you can okay you guys all right because what you don't want to do is be out here dry flaky dull okay around women that you are you know interested in 
make sure that you are setting a great example, a great impression on women. And the way that you guys can do that is by taking care of your skin because nothing will turn a woman off faster than a man that is just looking like a crunch bar. Okay. Looking like a powdered donut. All right. Just ashy flaky. We just don't need that. Okay. We don't need that. So go and get your tea Hanley. I promise you guys take it from your little big sister. Okay. I saw it fir firsthand on my friend, Leo. He was glowing. He, his skin was smooth. He smelled good. Like it, this product all around is beneficial. Okay. Look good, smell good, feel good. All right. But you guys, that was our dope discussion for today. You guys let me know how you felt about this quick dope discussion. Do you agree that these are some things that can and will absolutely turn women off. Let me know what you do personally to make sure that you are presenting yourself in the best light when it comes to women. And let's talk about it. And again, you guys do not forget to click that link down below and get your special box of T. Chanley. You got it. You got to get it. All right. You need it. All right. But I love y'all. I respect y'all. I'll see you guys in the next dope discussion. Like the video, share the video, subscribe. And again, special shout out to Teach Hanley for sponsoring today's dope discussion. I love y'all. See y'all in the next one. Peace.